Okay, hello. We are just getting set up. Let me know if you can hear me. This is Anita here of Liberate Me with Creation by Soul Design. And I'm here on my birthday to deliver this amazing workshop. Whether you're here live or on the replay, you can give us a hashtag replay. I just want to make sure that you can hear me. So we only set this up yesterday, so some of you may be catching this on the replay, but I really wanted to do this today. So let me just, uh, beautiful. Okay, sound is working. Brilliant. Okay, so let me see. Do, 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 do. I know a few people said they wanted to come. My phone is being a little jarring. Okay, so let me see. All right, let's have a look. So I'll just tag a few people in and then we will get started. So if you're here live, let me know. Oops. Let me tag the right people in. Okay. Beautiful. If you're here live, just say hello as you come on. I'm excited to do this today. Um, so I think Carmen says she wanted to come along. Let me see if I can just give. A little tag to a few people. If you know anyone, please tag them in. Um, put, or just put a love heart. It just allows more ladies to see this um, and get notification should they want to join live, okay? Um, otherwise, Facebook doesn't always show it because that's Facebook for you. You can't get into why that is. Just is the way it is. Okay, <laughs> uh, so these are a few that came through that I can remember off the top of my head. Where did she think? Okay, no, she, on the route, but she wanted to see it, so I'll invite her in later. Okay, so let's get started. So if you are here live, let me know, okay? a few more in that I can think of. Let's see if we can get a few more people in. Uh, we have a lovely new lady today as well. Hi, Manisha. Hey, 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 beautiful. When's it your birthday, Manisha? It's also quite soon, right? It hasn't already been. No, it's soon, it's soon. We will get started in just a moment. Okay. Ah, thank you. Thank you, gorgeous. That's nice of you. Yeah. Birthdays. Kind of crazy. Uh, all right. Cool. La, 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 la. Let's make sure the sound's working. Okay. I'm going to turn the sound off on my phone. Beautiful, okay. All right, so I'm just gonna get started and we can, I think we'll have a lot of replays for this one. If you're here in the background, say hi. Let me know where you're coming in from. And I'm gonna go, this is gonna be really kind of workshop style today, okay? So you can actually get something out of it, right? 7th of June, the big 40, woohoo! Oh, it's amazing. Welcome to the dark side, Manisha. It's 43 for me today. 43. Woohoo! Life gets better with age. It really does. I love birthdays. Yeah, me too. Absolutely. It's true. It's true. Um, okay. Yeah, it's a shame. It's kind of that Benjamin Button thing, right? You can't, it's, if you could start later on and go backwards, you know, just imagine how different that would be. Anyway, I digress. Um, all right. Let's get started. Are you ready? Do you get some pens or paper or something to write on? Um, some water, or whatever your tipple is. Okay, um, and we will get started. So today we are talking about law of attraction versus soul design. Uh, Carmen, hello, darling. Blessed birthday to a beautiful soul. 
May the Almighty continue to bless you with amazing earheads and lots of love. Oh, thank you so much, darling. Thank you so much. See, I just wanted to come and hang out with my favorite kind of women, liberated women on the rise. Yeah, I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Um, it's definitely my happy place, you know, the work that I do, the women I work with, you know. When you do what you love, it's just not work, right? It's just like a different level, different level. It's just amazing. So thank you for being here as well. You know, for me, it's amazing, absolutely amazing. Um, and I hope you get loads out of it today as well, okay? So we'll probably go for about, I'm not going to say 60 minutes, because it always says 90 minutes, but let's see how we go, <laughs> right? This is designed to be interactive, immersive, potent, so get involved, comment and all of those things and what's coming through for you, okay, as we be with this today. And I'll tell you a little bit more about what we're going to do in a minute. I'm just getting myself settled in, uh, getting myself settled in. So tell me, just as we open up, give me, if you are here live or if you aren't going to be watching the replay, then just give it a hashtag replay if you're on the replay. Give me one word, one word for um, how you feel about law of attraction, okay? And I just wanted to come really inspirationally, okay? And with no judgment, just be try to be really honest with yourself, okay? So for example, my word was frustrating, okay? <laughs> because, yeah. It just didn't go far enough. There was a lot missing, you know, and I and I, I do things to the absolute, you know, to, you know, I don't leave one stone unturned. So when something doesn't work, I know I've done, I've been with it fully, okay? Or, you know, there's something I miss, so I'll go over it again and again and again, right? So what's your one word for law of attraction, okay? Um, and as you feel into that, okay, whatever you're feeling right now, Okay, um, I, will, I just want to say a very big welcome to you all, okay, very big welcome to you, I'm a, I'm a bit, you know, excited about this, as you can see, as always, um, if you don't know who I am, I'm Anita Gaiso, I am the architect of quantum creation by soul design, okay, which I'm going to tell you about all about today okay, through this immersive workshop, and um, what else do you want to say? Yeah, the pioneer of Liberate Me, and it's my birthday, and I wanted to come and celebrate, so I wanted to do some of my favorite things, one of my favorite things is drinking tea, so I'm drinking my tea, <laughs> a lot of one of my favorite things is delivering all of this information that isn't out there, so women really have the chance to learn what they don't know uh, and can actually have big shifts, okay? So I'm really excited to be doing this today of all days, okay? Um, all right, let me just see. I just got a lot of message here. Um, if anybody else wants to join. Okay, fine. That's all good. All right. Um, okay, so let me fall into this a little bit. So today we're going to be talking about law of attraction versus creation by soul design, okay? Some of you will know what law of attraction is, some of you, I think a lot of you may know what a law of attraction is, and, and some of you that have, you know, depending how deep you've gone with creation by soul design, in terms of all the activations that we've got here, um, we'll know it or may not know it, but don't worry, wherever you are is perfect because we're going to go through it all today, okay? Essentially, they're about creating what we want, right, in life and what we desire um, in a way that feels good and that we can actually enjoy it, okay? Um, and what that actually takes. So that's what we're going to be talking about today. So for now, just give me one word on, or a couple of words if you can't do it in one word, or at least write it down on law of attraction, okay? What is what is it that you feel when I say law of attraction? This is not a trick question, okay? Like for me, it was frustrating, <laughs> right? Uh, even hard work, right? That may sound like, what? Well, that's weird that you're saying that, Anita, but you know, own your word, okay? And it will make more sense as we go. Um, 
So we're going to go on a mini journey together today to establish what each of these are, what law of attraction is, and what creation by soul design is, okay? Um, and the that's the number thing, one thing we're going to do, okay, to really define it, because I think it's really important to take a couple of steps back. Sometimes, as a uh, my soul design is a manifesting generator, uh, a sassy diva in my feminine trait design, okay, I can go a million miles an hour and um, lose everybody, okay, so you um, pull me back if I do, but here I, just, I do want to take it back a couple of steps, okay, so we can really understand what's going on here and what is the freaking difference and what, what is it that we're doing here, okay, so I want to talk about what are each of these, okay, and I want to talk about the soul destroying elements of law of attraction and what's missing okay um and so that's number two and number three we will be talking about creation by soul design the expose so really getting underneath the skin of creation by soul design all right and lifting a few more layers of this um you know the cloak, there is no dagger here, there's no cloak and dagger, it's not that mysterious, I want you to understand it so you can utilize it, be empowered by it, create what you desire from it, okay, so that's really what the intention is, so let me know, write down right now as we get started, and again, just so you know, this is not about slagging off law of attraction, not at all, okay, so put that aside, okay, this is not what this is about, um, but it is important that we're, what we're going to be looking at in terms of the soul destroying elements for certain types of women, including myself, and probably the woman, the woman that is here, okay, in this beautiful mission that we're on, okay, um, to not just create what we want, but to be able to enjoy it um, and hold it and continue to receive it, okay. So let's get into this, all right. So write down and feel free to share in the comments, what is your experience with law of attraction? What is your experience with law of attraction, okay? And to make that a little bit easier, maybe one thing you enjoy about it uh, or love about it and one thing that frustrates you. So if I was answering that question while you're answering it, it would be my experience with law of attraction is that I was really excited about law of attraction when I first discovered it. Um, and, you know, things like the secret, the book, the movie, the vision boards, the affirmations, and all of that stuff. And I went, you know, I went full on in it. I invested a lot of money in some gurus to teach me it. By that point, I started to get a little frustrated and a bit annoyed and even a little resentful, if I'm honest, right? Because I was like, this isn't working. You know, what am I doing wrong here? Like, I'm doing my affirmations, I'm doing all these things. And it was like working this through every day. And it was like this maintenance of it, okay? Positive thinking, positive vibration. That was something you said, Manisha, earlier that, you know, I think you were saying, Manisha, correct me if I'm wrong, that um, law of attraction needs to be updated to law of vibration. And it's about your vibration. Um, and that's also, you know, in, in soul design, that's a yes and a no, okay? We'll learn more about that as we go. That do we need to be in a good vibration to create what we desire, okay? So that was my experience of thing, uh, with it. I mean, one thing I loved about it is that it's so inspiring, you know, to visualize and see it and go into this happy place. Uh, and some of those things coming through. Hi, Zara. Oh, thank you, my darling. Thank you. So that's one thing I loved about it, okay? And the one thing that really frustrated me is that it didn't work every time or it took a lot of work, a lot of maintenance and it just became like a, to me, it sort of like hit me that, hold on a minute, you know, just like I was working hard in the nine to five corporate world, I'm working pretty hard on this, okay? <laughs> in, you know, maintaining my vibration, maintaining my affirmations, I am amazing, I am a millionaire, I am, high value and you know but I wasn't really feeling that underneath sometimes I would feel it okay um and the visualizing and all of that and it felt like it was coming from a very you know not quite the right energy okay 
Uh, and even if it was, it wasn't always working, okay? So it just felt like, you know, something's missing here and it's got to be easier than this. I don't need to, like, maintain this for the rest of my life. That To me, that just seems the same as what I call the sort of the patriarchal system, right? You know, where we just work hard and things happen and we achieve them, of course. Yeah, that's what happens, okay? Um, but I, I just thought there must be another way, okay? Because... <laughs> We can't be broken. We can't be having all these thoughts and emotions and feelings that we need to suppress in order to create what we desire, in order to attract, in order to become magnetic. Surely we haven't been made broken. Like what animal, what part of the ecosystem is broken? I mean, we as humans have broken things, right? <laughs> By meddling, but it isn't broken. So saying like in uh, human design that it is, Am I still live? I think it may have paused there. I'm just checking. Just let me know you can still hear me and I'm still live. I can see a bit of a pause. But uh, let me know. Manisha, trial and error have manifested quite a bit but didn't always work. There's always something missing. Yeah, exactly. Which I found pretty frustrating. Am I still live? Let me know. Am I still live? I'm just going to put it in the comments. Can you still hear me? I think there's a bit of a internet interruption. I'm just going to take a little tea break. Has this cut off? Let me know. Manisha, Zara, Carmen, anyone that's here. Can you just comment for me and let me know that you can still see me live and you can still hear me? Let me know. There was a pause, but it's cool again. Thank you, darling. Thank you so much for letting me know. Perfect. Okay. So, so what was your experience with law of attraction? One thing you love about it, one thing that frustrates you. Okay. So it's number one. Write that down. Do share it as well in the comments, please. Um, and number two, why are you here today? What is it that and I know you may think, I don't know why I'm here. I just came, you know, it just popped up or I just thought I'd come along because I fancied it. But um, there's always a reason why we're here. So again, just answer that from an inspirational place, okay? Um, I'm really sorry if the internet is coming in and out. Just keep me informed if there is a problem, okay? So why are you here today? So just write that down. What's your intention? What do you want to get out of it? And also tell me that because actually... The more you talk to me, the more you tell me why you're here, the more nuggets of gold that will come out specific for you, okay? That's when it gets um, really, really good. What's number one? I missed it. So number one is what's your experience? No, what? What's your experience with law of attraction, Zara? One thing you love about it, one thing that frustrates you, okay? Number two is why are you here today okay and this is about taking self-responsibility from a soul level so even if you don't know on a conscious level like why the fuck am i here <laughs> see if you can just take an inspirational i'm just looking at the internet and hoping it's staying dear oh dear i just see the camera flickering so i'm hoping it's working okay. Let me check on my own group. Hold on. Okay, looks like it. Okay, let's give you a bit more time to answer the questions. Okay, likes to make it a challenge. Um, yeah, keep me posted if you can hear me. Okay, um. Yeah, so why are you here today? So this is your feminine trait, okay? So we have a part of our feminine traits, which is part of the Liberate Me model. We won't go into it today. It's all up in the intro post if you're new, okay, which is the pin post. And you can work your way through the amazing complimentary free activations here based on your bespoke soul design and based on your bespoke feminine traits, okay? Uh, which is pretty incredible that that is all there for you. So there's so much you can get from that, okay? Um, mm, 
very concerned about this internet. Let me know, is it working for you guys? Seems to be a lot of pausing going on. Hmm. Let me know, darlings. The expression of our desires, a shopping list of wants of, of of a list of wants, not having a map to access our energy to bring it forward. It's like stumbling in the dark. Learn about energy and empowerment. Zara, oh my God, I couldn't have said it better myself. That is absolutely spot on, okay? And that's getting closer to creation by soul design, okay? Where there's no map to access it, okay? Um, I really hope the internet's working, okay? trying to get in our way <laughs> the energies that be okay um so that's number one what's your experience with law of attraction one thing you love about it one thing that frustrates you okay so you know where you are so we can shift you somewhere why you are here today is number two um and number three um uh, you know introduce yourself say who you are please do while you're here get to know each other where you're from and all of that, anything you want to say, okay? Um, and what brought you here today, that why, that's really important, okay? Just to feel into your soul, why am I here today? What is it that I'm, what is it that my soul is seeking, okay? Um, so that one thing you're hoping to get out of the workshop, okay? And what you want, and what you want to create, okay? So what is that one thing, or not, you know, I'm sure you want to create lots of things, but what's the one that's really, really you would love to have happen, okay, in the foreseeable future? Maybe something that you've tried law of attraction on and it may have fell short, okay? Um, that allows us to set something called the soul agreement, okay? That we say, I'm here for this reason. I am wanting this intention. And by being here and going through all of this, Kind of like a contra deal with universal source, okay? <laughs> if you want to see it that way, okay? Okay, you activ you activated first time I heard your decree. I love your energy. Beautiful. Thank you, Zara. Thank you. I love your energy as well. I love that description. Absolutely amazing. So my intention today, um, I've no idea how this internet is working, so just keep me posted. Um on your side because it seems to be like coming in and out from what I can see but I don't know if that's a true reality or not okay so just let me know let me have a look on uh, this side here okay it seems to be working here I think fingers crossed okay so my intention is that you're gonna walk away with a newfound awareness to utilize utilize creation by soul design to activate something you want to create in you or around you. Notice I say in you or around you. So this could be like intangible, you know, comfortable in your own skin, the confidence and all of those things, finding your voice, finding your validation from within, which is very important to have things happen around you, okay? And all the tangible, the money, the love, whatever it is, the lifestyle upgrade, the man, all of those things, okay? Um, I, I'm a stay-at-home mom and a birth anxiety coach. Love that. I love that. Birth anxiety coach. Amazing. Um, amazing. Beautiful. Um, yes. Okay. So that's what we're going to be walking away. We want to activate that in you. So feel into one thing you want to create if you haven't already and why you're here. Okay. So I, my intention is that you feel activated that you feel empowered to take a natural natural action embody, from embodying your soul design. So giving you that beautiful way that Zara explained it, giving you that access to the, to the map, okay? So in Law of Attraction, not having that map to access your energy, and not only just having a map, so here you're going to get the map, but the map is bespoke to you because you are one of a kind, you are bespoke, you are unique, okay? 
So the map cannot even be generic, okay? So this is what soul design is. So it's so beautiful that Zara brought that forward, okay? No surprises there, okay? Um, and number three, my intention is for this to be really potent for you, okay? So I invite you to really be here. Turn everything else off if you can. You know, allow yourself to fully be here because, you know, this will be life-changing if you allow it to be, okay? If you allow it to be. Okay, and now this is a giant topic. We will be scratching the surface today, okay? Familiarizing ourselves, getting a little excited, okay? I teach um, clients to introduce myself, the architect of their one-of-a-kind soul design and the activation of quantum creation. So um, I would not even say I was a coach anymore, really, because I don't try to coach the answers out of my clients or look at different options that might be viable, or follow a set of rules, or follow, you know, a, a generic approach, um, like law of attraction, or anything else that is generic. You know, I saw a post today about the rules, the book for dating, the rules, okay? Which I have a lot of opinions about, but I won't go into that now, okay? But more of an activator. You have everything you'd, you require inside of you to actually create what you're here to create, okay, what you what you desire, you don't desire by accident, you're so soul coded to desire that, okay, and that's why it's different for each of us, we all each have a spiritual IP as well, like an intellectual property, the, you know, thing, the gift, the purpose that people talk about, okay, but it's much, and it's not something you find, it's something that's activated in you, okay, so um, I work with women every day, that have struggled with so many modalities, okay, um, that are mind blown with the activation readings that they receive here. We do it very high level. You get your layer one activation in this group, complimentary, um, by, you know, go to the introduction post. I'm not gonna go through the instructions today, but they're all up there. Provide that information and you'll get your own soul design, your feminine trait signature, your false trait signature, which is false illusions that keep you stuck, um, and also we'll talk about your root wound. Those are the four pillars of Liberate Me, okay? And how this all comes together to create what you desire, okay? So my clients get weekly, daily activation readings, real time, day to day, week by week, that continually activates what they desire into existence, okay? So I can tell them what is forthcoming for them, um, through, I can read energy and I can, it's not psychic per se, but I can see what they can't see and what's coming forward in their soul design, okay? In, in quite a lot of detail when it comes to love, money, business, spiritual IP, pretty much everything, okay? What it related to the things that they want to create, okay? And how to actually activate that. And by doing the thing that I'm giving them to activate or the immersion, they are able to activate that into quantum creation and have it come into their existence, okay? Where law of attraction um, falls short of this because it's that generic modality, yeah? We know what we want, we got the list of wants, you know, like Zara was saying, but we don't have any map to really access that, okay? So we can slowly drive ourselves mad, visualizing, doing affirmations and getting nowhere fast. I'm not saying it doesn't work, it will have some success, okay, if you keep at it, like, it, just like, you know, working hard at something and focusing in a strategic way, it will work, but if you want an easier way, and I actually want to work with your natural soul design, in terms of what, you know, how to create things, and then this just might be for you, so I'm very happy you're here, whether you're here live or on the replay, okay, um, okay, so, that's me, that's what I do, okay? So this is not about slagging off law of attraction, okay, I'm not interested in that. This is about showing what is missing and, you know, why it doesn't cut the mustard for certain types of women, okay? Why it doesn't cut the mustard and because of what's going on beneath the surface, okay? Can you let me know if the internet is working and that you can hear me, Zara, Manisha, Carmen, anyone that's here, let me know. Um, in the comments because I can just see it's all flickering. I'm like, is this working or do I need to come off and come back on? Let me know. 
just give me a yes, it's working, or a no, and then I'll come off and I'll come back on and see if that helps. <laughs> Classic technology advice. Turn it off and turn it back on. Love some tea in the meantime. Let me know, ladies, if you can, if you can hear me, okay? And if the internet is working, I just feel like it's flicking a lot. Let me know. Yes, the internet is working. Okay, it just must be on my side then. Thanks, Zara. Perfect. All right, so let's crack on. <laughs> okay. So this is an unknown modality, creation by soul design. Um, to many, I know that because this has got out to the hundreds and not the thousands yet, as I would love it to do. So if there's anyone you feel this will benefit, definitely invite them into the space. Okay. Um, flicking a bit, but it's okay. Okay, sure. Um, thank you, Manisha. So, and I know it's an unknown modality because it's my spiritual IP. Okay. Yes, it includes parts of other modalities, but it also includes the Liberate Me um, pioneered signature formula, okay? And bringing it all together closes all the gaps and leaves no stone unturned. So you've got that map, okay? Literally, you get maps, okay? <laughs> Inside of the Liberate Me creme, okay? And by the way, stay to the end because I've got a very exciting birthday surprise for you because it's my birthday today did i say that did i mention that <laughs> right it's all about me no but um there's a i really want to celebrate it by doing something really really bonkers and crazy but what my soul design has said to do okay um so the creation by soul design access here um you're going to get some of that today all right i'm excited yay Happy birthday to ya. Right, if it's a happy birthday to me, it's happy birthday to you, right? So, <laughs> sharing is caring, people. Um, okay, so agreement of trust while we're in this place. So give me some love hearts. Please, this is the agreement of trust. So if you're, if you're like agreeing and you got to be in this beautiful circle of trust, be open is one of the things. Just throw me some love hearts if you're up for this. Active listening. Who knows what active listening is? Who's had some coaching training? Okay, active listening is listening not just with um, your ears, but with your eyes, your nose, your lips, your skin, your your you know your empathy, your energy, everything. Okay, so allowing yourself to fully be here. Okay, which is really important in soul design because it means you'll take stuff through. Okay, lots of love of hearts. Brilliant. Okay, no fixing, ladies. Okay. You do not need fixing. I'm not here to fix you. You are not broken, okay? You may feel like everything's wrong on a very high spectrum, okay? Or you may feel like, you know, nothing is wrong, but everything is wrong, like something just feels all right. But actually, you do not need fixing. You just require to embody your soul design, your feminine trait signature, all 27 layers of it, Remove the full straights and the root wound, okay? Essentially, that's it in a nutshell, okay? That is it, but you're not broken. That just requires healing, releasing, and activating. And those things are done in tandem in Liberate Me, okay? So what that means is, this is how we create, activate the quantum creation. So we don't need to fix each other. By that I mean, we don't need to give advice, okay? and tell people what to do, or anything like that, okay? So who's up for that? Give me some love hearts, no fixing, nothing is wrong. Okay, of course, in this beautiful, vulnerable space, okay, this is a private group. What goes on here, what happens in Vegas, stays in Vegas, babies, okay? What happens on Anita's birthday party in Vegas, stays in Vegas, okay? So, um, so confidentiality, okay? is really important in our agreement of trust. So give me some love hearts if you're up for that. Keeping the, you know, whatever is shared here stays here, okay? This, this agreement of trust goes for this and everything we do here, okay? I want to create a safe space, okay, for amazing women like the us that um, are not broken, do not need fixing, but want to be vulnerable and open up and see where that takes us, okay? So yeah, some love hearts, beautiful. Um, so another part of the agreement of trust as we get going, okay, 
is to be kind and sensitive. Always kind sensitivity. Hey, Lena. Lovely to have you here, darling. Okay. Kind, sensitive, compassionate. Okay. So that's another part of the agreement of trust in Liberate Me. Okay. We like to be compassionate. That does not mean we're pushovers. That does not mean we can't disagree and all of those things. Okay. But we do it with kindness, sensitivity. No one is broken. No one needs fixing. And with compassion. Okay. That is not all serious. We also want to have a lot of fun, okay? That's in our agreement of trust as well. So give me some love hearts for some fun or give me your favorite emoji for some fun. I like the dancing lady, personally. <laughs> right? um, and fun, respect, and bottom line it, okay? Fun, respect, and bottom line it. What do I mean? Right, respect, I think we all know what respect is, okay? So lots of uh, respect as well, even though um, I used to sing that song to my mum now, now I'm thinking of my birthday. I don't know if anyone knows it, Mel and Kim. Um, I ain't never gonna be respectable, day, day, day. Okay, not a lot of you are gonna know that, okay? But, <laughs> and I can't sing. <laughs> right? But uh, we, we do want to keep some respect here. That doesn't mean that we can't be open and vulnerable and all of that, okay? So give me some love hearts for that, all right? Uh, bottom line, it, you know, it just means, you know, in your comments, you know, really distill them and give me the, the seed of it, okay? And you can write more in your journal because then we can, we, I mean, the more you comment, the more it will come through. If you're just joining us, um, number one, give us your, what we've done so far is number one, how, what has been your experience with Law of Attraction? What do you love about it? What do you hate about it? So Lena and a few others that have joined. If you can write that down or post it. Number two, why are you here? What is it that you would love to get out of today? Ask your soul or your feminine traits if you don't even know why, okay? Um, so we can plant that in the soul agreement while we have some fun today, okay? And everything that, you know, what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas. This is a sacred space, okay? A sacred space. So leave it in the room. Leave it here in Creation by Soul Design, okay? So are we all in for that? Give me a hell yes. Give me some love hearts. Give me yes in the comments if you're all good with that, okay? And we shall crack on. All right, I need to keep an eye on the time. I think we, yeah, okay, we're doing good. All right, let's get started. Let's go deeper. Let's do some tea first. Okay, so my story. Okay, so I spent years, okay, because so we said we're going to talk about what is law of attraction, what is creation by soul design, what the frick is the difference. Anyway, Anita, <laughs> right? And, um, you know, the, the soul destroying parts of law of attraction and the missing parts um, and the creation by soul design expose, what this is all about, okay? I do not, yes, Zara, thank you for actually confirming your, to the agreement of trust, okay? Uh, and honoring that, you know, if you can say yes in the, in the comments, ladies, that really helps, but at least say yes yourselves, or I know you've been throwing some love hearts, so that's amazing as well, okay? It just helps to confirm that and put us in that sacred space, okay? So, um, yes, and so I may not get through the whole of creation by soul design expose explained today okay but we'll go as far as we go and maybe i'll do a few more lives this, this week okay if you would like that okay i feel up for coming live this week my soul just made it up for it so let's see okay um so like i say i spent a lot of years suffering you know in in in, in soul destroying ways okay trying to get where i needed to be okay oops Am I still here? I saw the screen go blank. Let me know. Okay. I'll just take a look. It looks like I am still here. Funny old internet today. I spent years suffering in soul destroying ways of trying to get where I needed to be to find myself, to stop feeling um, like I was feeling, you know. Uh, and I wasn't even feeling real sometimes, you know. It was a painful existence. Um, I looked fab on the surface, you know, this is really my story, maybe fit into your story. Um, um, you know, and a lot of you will know, I'm not going to go into my whole story, but I come 
from a background of um, physical abuse. My dad took his own life, God rest his soul, uh, when I was 17. Um, and I was a, um, you know, I was a powerful people pleaser. So I really lost myself, right? I've since transferred that power to other areas, okay? Uh, so I went through a long journey of healing and still found it hard to create what I desired. So, um, and that's because the root issue was never addressed. And frankly, I was too smart for it, right? <laughs> I was too smart for my therapist, right? Um, so, you know, and it was not addressed, okay? In a way, I, you know, I'm not saying it wasn't addressed at all. It was, absolutely, okay? But um, not in a way that I activated anything that was very different for me, for me, almost. Like I had a corporate careers and I, you know, I had a husband and things like that and a car and a home, you know, all the things, um, the so-called dream. But that dream wasn't coming from the truth of who I was. That dream was coming from my false traits. I didn't know anything about false traits, okay? Which is a, a, a false illusion of who we are and what we truly desire, okay? And, what is available to us, okay, Con from conditioning and all of those things. Uh, and it's rooted in a root wound. And that never came through in any of this um, help that I got, okay. This is my personal story, okay. I'm not saying this is the way for everyone, but let me know if you resonate or what, what, what's been your story as well, okay. I'd love to hear um, if you want to share, okay, or at least acknowledge it for yourself, okay. Because it's good to know where you've come from, to be like, does that really work for me? And what is it I need now? What else is it I need now? What is missing? And does this fill the missing piece for me or not, okay? You're an empowered person, you decide that. Um, so this is a way to activate, you know, it didn't activate the creation of my true self and what I truly, truly wanted. So yes, I got everything I dreamed of. I had the dream life and, you know, and I didn't feel real. I felt like I was outside of myself looking in. Um, you know, like that imposter syndrome, like a fake and all of those things. Like, and I still very much needed my validation from the outside in, okay? I didn't get my validation from the inside, okay? Uh, so this is what, you know, this, this is a journey that led to the inception and the birth of Liberate Me. And it is my birthday today. So, you know, so let's birth something new here, right? I want to birth something new and my next level and I hope you will birth something new. So if you haven't said why you're here yet, or what is the thing that you would love to birth and create right now, um, then put that soul agreement in place now, okay? Put your intention in place. Who is it you wanna be, okay? So we have a feminine trait activation in the guides. Have a look at that, do the quiz. There's a whole activation there, okay? A layer one, completely complimentary, okay? Uh, and, it, and it gives you how to be with your intention to liberate me way, the first layer of that, okay? It's all layered learning in, in liberate me, okay? Because we have to look, upgrade your system um, and then upgrade it and upgrade it and upgrade it, okay? If you gave it all at once, it would just go, no, and your, your full straight and your root room would have you run very fast in the other direction, okay? <laughs> so we do it layer by layer so it's potent and it actually, you can see actual things activating in your life, okay? So, um, yeah, so what's that one thing you want to create, okay? Um, and now, you know, looking at so many soulful women out there, you know, such as you beautiful women here, uh, happy birthday, happy, happy birthday to you, Anita. Oh, thank you, Lena. Mwah. Thank you, appreciate it. Uh, all of you soulful women, okay? Um, but we're not living in, you know, in a soul-led, conscious way a lot of the time at all. Most of the time, we're living out of our head, okay, or out of our full straights or out of our root wound and our subconscious programming, okay? Um, would you agree? Let me know. I'm going to take a sip of drink. Celebrating the soda. Okay, I'm sorry if this makes a massive sound, but it's a can of soda, but I need to open it so I can... Stay liberated, okay? Oh my God, so it is so good. Okay, okay. So, 
There's so many soulful women out there that are burning ourselves or burning themselves out, right? In the bid to be successful, in the bid to figure everything out, analysis paralysis, you know, and this is when you're in your out of sync feminine traits, okay? Um, and which takes you into your false traits, which takes you into your root wound, and you start to operate from there. So, and this stuff starts to, you know, turn on you in some ways, okay? But very easy to flip over. I mean, I say easy with a word of caution. I'm not saying it's easy peasy, okay? But m much easier than you think, okay? Okay? Uh, and, and what this ends up women doing, in my experience, or the clients that come in to liberate me, is keeping ourselves or themselves locked away from love, even when love is right there, or self-sabotaging love or money or success, you know, when it's right there. Right? And don't allow yourselves to receive it. Who's ever experienced that? I know I have. Okay? Not even realizing I'm doing it. Okay? Because it's so such a powerful force trait energy. Okay? Um, with the walls up so high. Okay? From fear. Uh, all these things. Okay? Because they don't, like Zara said beautifully earlier, with law of attraction, we have nothing to replace it with. Right? So we can want all these things. We can desire all these things. But with soul des design, when we dismantle the false traits and the root wound, we give you your soul design, literally, you, you know, those that are in the program, you literally get your dossier of your soul design, your spiritual IP, your layers of your feminine traits, okay, weekly activations, daily activations, <laughs> you know, literally you've got something to replace it with, okay? to embody, you don't have to go and figure it out, like, who am I, and, you know, I, we've got to try to coach it out of you, and then, you know, be told that maybe you're not doing it right, and that's why you're not, you know, getting it, okay, it's literally given to you, um, so there's, the, the fear can dissipate, okay, give me a um, love heart in the, in the chat, if that makes sense, or if you have questions, um, please, uh, please ask them, okay, because then I can explain that a little more, because it's really important to get that, okay? Um, because what this means is that you can actually start receiving, okay? Rather than feeling absolutely petrified or pretending you're not petrified, okay? <laughs> and being really strong uh, and pushing what you desire away or not even allowing yourself to even desire it, okay? Um, and and, uh, and self-sabotaging. So trust me, I've been there a lot. Tell me I'm not alone. Okay, give me some love hearts if you've been there, okay? Um, but what I want to say, it's not necessary, okay, in Creation by Soul Design. You can cut all of that out, okay? All of it, and it's quite the opposite, okay? So it breaks my heart that so many people out there are in so many different modalities suffering, trying to figure shit out, okay? Here, I, I literally give it to you, right? I read you, I give it to you, I identify your root wound, um, you know, because you can't see what you can't see otherwise, otherwise you would have done it by now, you're not stupid women, you're intelligent, highly aware, and some of you very advanced in your spiritual or energetic journey, but wherever you are in spirituality or energy, it doesn't matter, even if you've never heard of it, this is still gone, going to work for you, so this, my darlings, is the expose, okay? Love heart, Lena. Okay, thank you, darling. <laughs> so not just me, right? Um, so, so what is it that soul design will take away from you? Take away from you. Those soul destroying things, okay? That there is no need for. So, for example, do we have any business ladies here? Entrepreneurs, give me a yes, yes. Holla, holla to the power ladies in the house. Okay. That would be me. I'm definitely a, a business lady as well, okay? Not that I see it that way, and you won't. Once you're in your spiritual IP, you'll just be doing it for the love of it. Uh, it's, it's just really phenomenal, okay? So one of the things it takes away, so write these down. Creation by soul design takes away the soul-destroying need for the numbers game, okay? Who's heard about the numbers game? Okay, this is not just in business. It's in dating, right? There's so many dating, like, love coaches out there, like, with the rotational dating, 
or you know you've got to do six posts a day if you're a businesswoman you got to reach out to you know these kinds of people you've got to have you know your ideal client you know absolutely now this is all and I say this with love absolute bullshit okay it's not required in soul design none of it okay uh, and that might be a bit shocking to some of you <laughs> depending how long you've known me but I promise you there's a robust map as the lovely Zara put it okay behind this that is bespoke to you one of a kind that literally you come in we, you know, we dismantle your false traits and your root wound, and we give you what to replace it with, okay? Literally for you, all with a beautiful bow, because it is a birthday right today, but you get that, because it is like your birthday, you know, when you join Liberate Me um, in a more fuller way, or if you're here at this level, that's what it's like, okay? Um, there's no, we don't do any challenges here, or, you know, just telling you bits and pieces to get you over the line. I give you real things to activate you and real support at this layer inside Creation by Soul Design inside of this group, which is complimentary at the moment, okay, um, for this layer. But like I say, I've got something very special, okay, at the end of this, a big birthday bonanza that I can't believe I'm doing. Um, but um, yeah, so stay to the end for that, okay, and I'll tell you all about that. Um, so it takes away the need for the numbers game, okay, do we like that? Okay, let me know if you like that. Give me some love hearts if you like that, okay? Or if you enjoy the numbers game, I don't know, okay? Um, it takes away the need for being stuck in a job that you're waiting to leave before going full in with your passion, okay? There's no need to do that, okay, with Creation by Soul Design because we can activate this at a level of speed and create that quantum creation, okay? So, um, which is wonderful, right? Because this idea of like keeping a job and trying to have a side hustle you know, if you could get out of it, you want to get out of it, right? So give me a, a yes, yes, if that's something that appeals to you as well. It takes away the need for goals, plans, strategies, and even law of attraction, okay? The affirmations and the visualizations. You may still decide to do them. I'm not saying there's nothing wrong with them. And if they come up from you through your soul design and you want to utilize them, you totally can, okay? This isn't a vigilante against law of attraction. It's just the incompleteness of it, okay? It also takes away the soul-destroying need of constant healing and constant maintenance of our triggers. Halla fucking hallelujah, right? So it takes away the need for that, which I think is amazing, okay? Amazing, okay? It also takes away the need for staying stuck in the Groundhog Day, okay? If these sound good to you, give me a yes. If you have any questions, feel free to put them in the comments as well, now or later, because I know it's a lot to take in as well, okay? It takes away the need for the daily rituals of law of attraction, okay? Um, the affirmations, the visualizing, keeping positive thoughts, all that jazz, okay? Um, it's, and it also takes away the, you know, which really becomes a full-time job, okay? Even in law of attraction, which kind of stunned me. Isn't this meant to be law of attraction? Oh, I'm in a city and look at a check of a hundred million dollars and it's just meant to like fall in my lap. Isn't that the way it's meant to work? Okay. <laughs> you gotta laugh. You gotta laugh. Okay. Um, it takes away the need as well. So, you know, for soul destroy need of having to follow rules and strategies to chase love. Okay. Or follow business strategies to the T for you to make it. You don't need any of that stuff. Yeah. Yeah, Zara, shadow work is never freaking ending, okay? And that's because it doesn't get to the root, okay? It doesn't get to the root wound. It doesn't give you anything to freaking replace it with. It doesn't give you your activation readings that are bespoke to you, so you know who you are and how to activate you very specifically, okay? It doesn't give you all of that, okay? So you can be there forever and ever and ever, right? It's a job, exactly, right? It's a job. It's like a trick. I was like, hold on a minute. I just thought I left the prison of the corporate world and I actually just created another prison for myself. Bloody hell, Nina. <laughs> that was good work, right? Not easy to admit, but I'm glad I could admit it to myself. And here, as liberated women, as soul conscious women, I'm just going to pause there because I saw a flicker. We are happy to admit those things, okay? For our growth, okay? To rise, okay? To rise into our creation powerhouses which is something we activate within Liberate Me, okay? And how instead it activates 
in creation by soul design simply from embodying your individual your one of a kind soul design do you do you believe you're one of a kind okay because you are one of a kind so please put that in the comments one of a kind okay so unless and this is why you know in liberate me i don't do generic coaching and throw it out everywhere it's very much you know um boutique high end if you like but by high end i mean it's um it's high quality okay um it's bespoke to you you get a lot of freaking attention as a liberate me client right any clients that can validate that i'm sure right and we'll sip okay so it's embodying your individual one of a kind soul design okay um by embodying parts of you that you you didn't even know about yourself so there's things that you go around saying you know do you ever say that's not me i would never do that that's not me i don't believe in that that's not me i wouldn't do things like that because that's not me <laughs> right have you ever said that? Who's ever said that? I've definitely said that. Okay, give me some love hearts. Come on. Okay, we're in a safe space here. Remember, we've got our agreement of trust, okay? Absolutely, okay? Um, we Here you want to be open to everywhere we're saying, that's not me. Where is that coming from, okay? And is it conducive? And is it even true, okay? So we want to be open to dismantling that, which is mind-blowing and exciting in itself, okay? So creation by soul design does not require hard work, okay, in the traditional world, in, in the traditional way, okay, um, which is depressing to think we, you know, when you're going for law of attraction, you think this is going to be a fun thing, where you're just like, you know, like Harry Potter, it's like ding, 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 you know, whereas creation by soul design is more of that, okay, but it is not like, oh, this is magic, you know, you're just going to sit there and there's a real, you know, and I, I, you know, as we did the, um, when we did Creation by Soul Design Live, which is all now in the guides, go through that because it's pure freaking gold, if you haven't been through that yet. Um, we were using the hashtag magic logic, okay? So give me a hashtag magic logic in the, in the comments if you, if you choose. Because there is logic behind this, like Zara was saying, there's a map behind this, there's logic behind this, okay? Um, which is really, really important. Okay, um, so this is elevation. So yes, it highlights where you have conditioning, okay? Um, and it identifies the exact soul design emergence you require to release it, okay? So in soul design, it is the smallest shift in self that causes the biggest creations. So that could, you know, that cannot be achieved, in my humble opinion, with the soul-destroying hard work of the above things, because actually it takes you into avoidance of those things. Okay, it says that we're broken. Okay, so these are, and this is just outdated uh, um, and not necessary. Okay, hashtag magic logic, Benisha, love it. Yeah. Okay, so let me just see uh, how long we've been on. This is still ticking over. Double checking the internet. Okay, yeah, I was gonna say it's been longer than that. Okay. Okay. So we probably get like another 20 minutes, 25 minutes, 30 minutes max. Okay. Um, so this is really the expose. I wanted to give you. There's so much to this. So I think I'll do a mini series if you're up for it. Creation by Soul Design explained the expose to go more into this. Okay, but let's see where we get to today. So you are not broken, right? Source, universe, God, whatever you believe in, did not make you broken, did not make you experience emotions, okay, that you are required to suppress, okay? They, they work within your soul design to create. So you are just apart from the very thing that creates from you at the moment or have some distance from it, okay, or don't have sight to it, which is your very own soul design. Okay, you can get layer one activation right here in this group, okay, which is all up in the pin post, okay. So once you have this with the insight into your personal soul design, you know, like your personal soul design files, if you like, if someone giving you a dossier, you're just like, freaking hell, 
I wish I knew this before, right? And that's what you get here, all right? And then you get it real time as you become a client. We go, we go layer by layer, okay? So this is um, anything you're feeling is like there's nothing you can't get unstuck from at a level of speed here, okay? So this is the insight, okay, behind the scenes um, of the activation layers in creation by soul design and how it can be used for immediate creation, okay? And I've given layer one here in this in this space, in this group, okay? Um, and it really, you know, for me, healing without creation of what you desire and that not happen in tandem. So it's not like, okay, we're gonna heal your root wound, we're gonna heal your false trait, spend years on trying to get rid of your shadow, uh, and then we're gonna, you know, create what you desire. No, 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 right? This all happens together, right? So law of attraction doesn't even make any sense when it comes to that, because obviously you're feeling feelings that do not feel good sometimes, right? Looking at your root wound and your false trait, and you're feeling tensions, and then you're feeling elation, okay? So you're feeling all kinds of emotions, and you're having all kinds of thoughts and feelings, okay? But you're doing it with the facilitation of myself, if you're having my support, okay? And the activation of your soul design, okay? With that information, which is very different, okay? Um, and that's the point, it all happens in tandem here. It does, it happens not even in duality, but with all of it, but at least in duality. And actually that's what's required to create, okay? Not to be trying to suppress our thoughts, being a high vibe, being a high vibe, you know, pretend, pretend, pretend. Say this on a date, do this on a date, or, or whatever it is, or do this to, you know, get business, or get, all of that, okay? Because that's all strategic, quite contrived, really, it's quite contrived. And we weren't made broken, we actually have a soul design, okay? So, what is, um, so that's that, okay? So that was a big piece. Like, give me one word, ladies, for how you're feeling now. And I'm, you know, I'm gonna go into next, what is law of attraction and what is it not, okay? And what is um, creation by soul design? And what is it not, okay? And then I will announce the beautiful thing I've got for you all for my birthday, okay? Uh, in celebration, which is a kind of crazy thing, okay? At the end of this. So give me one word while I have a sip of soda. Maybe not a sip, a gulp. <laughs> okay. So what is law of attraction? Please feel free to comment in what you feel law of attraction is as well, okay? Because we talked at the beginning about what is your experience of law of attraction. So feel free to answer that now, if you're coming on now, or if you're coming on later, give us a hashtag replay as well, so I know you're here, because I like to say hi. And so law of attraction is based on the belief that positive and negative thoughts bring positive and negative experiences into a person's life. Hmm. Right? It's, the belief is based on the ideas that people and their thoughts are made from pure energy and that a process of energy attracting like energy exists through which a person can then improve their health, their wealth, their personal relationships, okay? Would you agree? Is that your understanding of law of attraction? That is like a, a, a dictionary meaning of it, okay? <laughs> so there is no empirical scientific evidence for supporting law of attraction. Um, and that's not to say that it doesn't work, okay? But that's just the definition of it. So essentially what you focus on becomes things, okay? Well, to me, okay, in my humble um, opinion and journey, you know, the, what I call the, the yes, Sarah, beautiful, okay? The um, patriarchal system of, you know, what we all know, okay, institutions, schools, education, degrees, marriage, and, and the, you know, the path that we all know, okay? Um, of course, you know, what we focus on became things. I had a successful, yeah, um, corporate career, okay, after having therapy and things like that as well, 
but it, it had me create things from false traits, not from my feminine traits, not from my soul design and the truth of who I am, because I had no freaking clue what that was. Uh, and we didn't get to the root, okay? So we kind of just covered it all up, okay? Understood it happened and I had the awareness, but did it stop the experiences? Hell no, hell no, okay? I just got better at hiding it, okay? So, um, so that to me, law of attraction of what you focus on becomes things is very much the same as the patriarchal system, really, right? A different system for the same thing, right? Work hard, focus on these things and it will happen. Take loads of action, okay? So there's not so much action taken in creation by soul design, okay? It's more of a being and an embodying and an activating, okay? Uh, for these things to come into existence, all right? Uh, which is quite the shift for most ladies that come in here or who are high achieving women like myself, feel we have to work hard or we don't even deserve it unless we work hard for it, to, to pull that back and to activate things. You know, the work is to embody our soul design and our, and our embodiment of our feminine traits, right? Fully and naturally through the dismantling of the false traits and the root wound, okay? You'll notice that law of attraction doesn't include any of those things, okay? So that's the main difference, okay? So in creation by soul design, it doesn't ma mean because you're focusing on your root wound or your full straight, or you're having a, um, a, a feeling or feeling sad or that you're not gonna be able to create because in your soul design, um, if you have an emotional um, center as your inner authority, for example, okay? Because each of our soul designs is different, then actually you require to feel your emotions to create. You actually require to feel your emotions to create. So if you're suppressing that, okay, and that, this will be individual to each of you, if you're suppressing that, then you're actually blocking the creation or you're limiting it to what you're focusing on, okay? Does that make sense? I don't mean to be facetious, okay? Uh, I, you know, all respect, this is with respect, with love, but I've got, you've gotta say how it is sometimes, ladies, okay? So we can break down the false traits for those of you that this will serve. So let me know if that makes sense, what law of attraction is. Give me a yes, give me some love hearts, and give me your thoughts, okay, as well. I'd love to hear your thoughts and your feelings as you're hearing this. So what is, what, so that's what law of attraction is. So what is it not, okay? So it's not healing, okay? It doesn't do any of the healing, okay, at all. It just completely bypasses that. To me, that's like, you can't by, bypass that because we, you know, that, that's the root wound and the false traits. And they're so, they're actually important for creation because they're, they actually, they're for transcendence. Because it, when you have a root wound and you have a false trait, which we all do, right? They're just in the, the subconscious and they've been given to you for you to identify so you can pick them up and go, oh, that's not mine. Okay, and you didn't come into this world with that, okay? Or it's ancestry, but it's not mine, okay? So it's like, oh, universe, you can have that back, or source, okay, or whichever way around you, okay? I don't require that, okay? And it's, oh, thank you so much. I can now transcend that, okay, alchemize it, if you like, into the creation of what you do desire, okay? What you do want to embody, okay? So we require those pieces. So it doesn't have that healing part, okay? So accepting that any of these so-called negative thoughts um, in law of attraction is actually part of creation and they have a purpose, right? Otherwise, we would not be having them. We were not made broken, okay? We were not made broken, okay? It assumes, law of attraction assumes we are broken. Makes total sense. I'm glad, Lena. I mean, the more we understand this, the more we can excel in it, okay? So that's why I wanted to do this. Okay, it's kind of, you know, I kind of went, you know, which is a very much, you know, my soul design, part of it has been a, a manifesting generator, okay, which is the human design part of this. And this is human design and not human design because it's merged with feminine traits, the false traits, the root wound, and so much more, okay? And my reading of you, okay? So it's not that alone, okay? So it's, that's not what it's about, but on the, on that side of it, you know, the manifesting generator, I go to the other side, so I start at the end and then go back to the beginning. So you'll see that I took you all to a very advanced state with the activations in creation by cell design in this group, okay? And now I'm going back to basics, right? 
because and that's and that's actually how I create by my soul design okay some of you will have that too or versions of that or variations of that okay but if you don't know that you're gonna think you're doing it wrong and follow a strategy step by step and that's actually going to block your creation okay so it, it tells us we need to suppress, we need to not go by our soul design, we need to follow strategies, steps, and, and everything will work out, okay? And it will work out, but it will work out what you're focusing on. It's not going to give you the absolute magnitude of your soul design and what that has in store for you, which is purely out of your sight and unimaginable to you right now. You can't visualize it because there's too much um, force straight and root moon that would be getting in the way, okay? You can't see what you can't see, and that's why I see it for you in your activation regions, in your love life, in your business life, in your money life, and you're like, this is happening for me? What? Wow. And you're like, oh, wow, right? And this is how you activate it, okay? So we shortcut all of that, okay? And that's as a client of um, Liberate Me, okay? Um, those um, very personalized activation readings that I give. All right, which I really enjoy doing because I get to go sit in each of your energies and be with that and give you that. I just love it. Okay, I just love doing that. Um, so, in the norm, you know, it's this idea that, you know, that the gurus out there, the law of attraction gurus, and, you know, no, I know it's all good intention, but nobody can stay in one state of feeling. And emotion and state of mind like positive 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 all of the time I mean it's scary it's Stepford Wives right? <laughs> uh, and it's not creation by self-design okay it's limited in what it can create even the gurus okay it's not possible okay they were required to fake it at times okay to keep it going and it's because they've been told that's the teaching that you know and nothing belongs to anyone anything you learn you know Teach what you know. That's what I, I believe myself. Okay, so, so, but at the same time, it doesn't make me sad. Okay, it makes me sad because um, it's leaving women feeling like they're broken. Like, why isn't this working for me? You know, I'm doing all this work. Okay, so the truth is, you don't need to stay in that one state of mind, that one state of feeling, that positive vibration. I know, Manisha, you were talking about that. Okay, so the truth is that that's not the case. Okay, it's about activating your creation. By soul design okay your particular soul design and those readings that are given to you um literally okay so it's not easy of um is um so of course anything you focus on intensely will happen like i said i had a corporate career for 18 years okay uh and a degree and all of that um you know every a lot of things i wanted and i essentially I got that through, you know, graft, hard graft, pushing myself, maintenance. And to me, law of attraction is no different, okay? So those are, you know, you know, are, that are fully, you know, more intense about it, uh, and you're working like crazy on something, of course that's going to work out, okay? But if you like to feel intense and you like to feel like you're working crazy on something, then that, that maybe that is for you, okay? And there's no problem with that. You get to choose. For me, I like things to be a little bit more relaxed uh, and, and natural. So which one are you? Are you more like intense or relaxed, okay? <laughs> those are two words. You can put those in the chat. Do you like an intense way to create, you know, up against it, you know, like all those job descriptions in the corporate world, you know, does well under pressure, can multitask, basically do everything, right? or in a more relaxed way? Which one? Which one do you want to choose? Put your order in now, okay? Put it into the comments, let me know. I'm definitely more relaxed, okay? So it's quite punishing, okay? Um, law of attraction in many ways to me, okay? Um, and again, not slagging it off, okay? You get to choose what works for you in life, okay? Um, each, each to their own. But in its current form, I believe it's limited um, and it does more damage than good, okay? And it's based in some delusion, okay? Or at least missing parts, okay? Um, so let me know now as we've got to the end of that, my darlings. Let me check all the time and please answer this question. What has that activated in you, okay? What has that activated in you? I'm just gonna put a stop here on my nose because I'm gonna do some, I've got so much here for you ladies that we do a little series 
Creation by Soul Design Explained, okay? I'll try to come live as often as I can, okay? What has that activated in you? What is one thing that that has activated in you, okay? So please answer that question, okay? Because that's what, what's going to create some shift from you on this mini session that we've had today, okay? Where we started, okay? The questions I asked, and if you're on the replay or you join later, go back to the beginning. But even if you just, you know, joined and you've heard what you've heard, what is one thing that's activating you? It's really important to acknowledge that. What is that activating in you? Even if that's one word, okay? I'm just going to take a sip while you think of that. Okay. What is one thing that's activated in you? And just as we come to a close, before I go into the birthday bonanza, okay, for my birthday, it's my birthday, did I mention that? <laughs> um, yeah, sorry, I make myself laugh sometimes. See, it's all about having a good relationship with yourself, okay? But a lot of people will think you're insane, but that's good, because it probably means you're in your soul design, if that's the case, okay? Um, so what is one thing that's activated in you or one thing that you feel, now I know that I will do this thing differently from now on, okay? So what's that? Okay, so Manisha, more relaxed would be better. So you're a soul design ladder. Welcome. Zara, more relaxed. Beautiful. You're a soul design lady. And thank you for your beautiful explanation at the beginning, Zara. That's amazing. Loved that. Loved that. That really just set it up. Good confirmation codes, as I call them, those synchronicities that are coming in. Calm knowing is the activation. Exactly. And that's what soul design is. That's beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. So as you come up with those ladies, I'll go into the birthday bonanza. Put myself first before others. Beautiful, Lena. So that, Lena, is beautiful what you just brought up, okay? We have a force trait activation in, in the guides, okay? Um, and one of the pillars there is when we are in our prostitute of um, putting others before ourselves, getting our validation from the outside in and why we do that and how to transcend that, okay? So, um, and how to move into what we call your lover, okay? which is based on um, transcending those false traits. So have a look at that as well, Lena, because that will help you with that uh, and be with that. Not giving, giving away myself. Absolutely. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay? Love it. Love it. And we'll go more into creation design, you know, by soul design, explain and expose uh, and exactly what this is, you know, in some more lives, Okay? So, my darlings, it is my birthday today, okay, as you all know, and I'm feeling crazy, crazy generous, and I'm having a 24 hour, 24 hour, 24 hours from the minute you get in touch with me, okay, so from, from whenever you watch this, because I want to give the replay ladies a chance, okay, from whenever you watch this and you PM me, um, you will have 24 hours personal to you, okay? To get 50% off all Liberate Me programs. Yes, okay? I've never done this before. I'm probably never going to do it again, okay? Or maybe, I don't know, maybe I will. I can't say that for sure. But I'm not planning to, okay? <laughs> so, but we don't plan and so design, obviously. So this is absolutely insane. But I really felt compelled for my soul design um, to bring this forward just for 24 hours from the minute you get in touch with me, okay? Like, hello, Anita, I'm interested, tell me more, okay? Um, so let me tell you a little bit more about that now, okay? Um, Zara, I need reading glasses. Turning inwards, anchored in myself, and energy at the first instance, beautiful. Self-referencing versus thinking um, of... 3D other circumstances, beautiful. I love that, that's got so much depth, wow. Enjoy your day, party fully. <laughs> Lena's giving me permission to party, not that I need permission. I will, darling, I will. 
Oh, party time. Um, so we have a program named The Creme. I will put the details in the comments here after. Okay, that includes it all. Okay, this is the natural next step to release the root wound, to transcend the false traits, to enter your one of a kind bespoke creation by soul design, to, to be given and enter in a body and immerse into the 27 layers of your bespoke feminine traits and to activate your bespoke creation powerhouses. You receive, and I just think these are just one of the most amazing things and worth it alone, but you receive weekly activation readings for me. They are written readings um, telling you what is going on in your life, what's forthcoming, love life, money life, business life, you name it, it's there, what requires to be activated, where you're in false trait, where you're in the moon and how, where to go to, to, um, to activate that, to go through the immersions, okay? Very simple, very potent, okay? These, these are your new plans, if you like, okay? So we love it when you're part of your <laughs> And in the cram, we have a rendezvous, okay? There will be an event that you will be invited to at some point over the next 12 months, okay? somewhere in the world that so we get together and we get to party. I should have some champagne, but I don't. That would be nice. Um, okay, everybody have some champagne for me today and then post up a picture of yourself with the champagne, okay? And I'll do it too at some point. <laughs> it doesn't have to be champagne if you don't drink champagne, okay? Whatever, a cup of tea, okay? Whatever it is. That would be so cool. That would make me so happy. Okay, so we actually do have a rendezvous, which is part of the creme as well, okay? Talking about partying. Um, and activating. So you will receive bespoke activation readings weekly that tell you what's coming for you and how to activate it. These are so freaking powerful alone, I can't even express, okay? This alone is worth the investment. If someone could have given me this stuff like 10 years ago, I would be a lot further than I am even today, okay? Um, Anita's work is nothing less than exceptional, amazing. Oh my God, thank you, Lena, for saying that. Sweetie, so Lena, Lena is in the creme. I love you so much, darling. Oh, that's really sweet. Um, so you will access a whole 12 months at half the investment. You may say, oh, 12 months, that's a long time. It's not, okay? <laughs> All right. It's really, you know, it's, like I say, it happens in tandem. It happens immediately in days, weeks, and months, okay? But it's 12 months to mastery of this stuff, of, of your soul design which took you all the years. Take your age, that's how long you've probably been living in not your soul design, in the full straits, in the root wound, without even realizing, okay? So 12 months is nothing, and you're worth it, and we have so much fun, okay? It's so amazing. My, my clients turn up to the course because, you know, we, you're never behind. There's, there's no system. I mean, there's plenty for you to go through. You know, the programs are there. There is structure, so don't worry, okay? But um, it's, it's just basically 12 months of uh, absolute amazingness. And with this, with 50% off for 24 hours from when you contact me, okay, only for this time only, okay, it's basically six months of absolutely complimentary support. I mean, what the fuck, okay? Sorry to swear. But sorry, but not sorry, right? <laughs> so it's crazy, crazy doors. I'm super, super, super excited about it. So if you've been on the fence, this is your time, lady. So get off the fence and get creating, okay? I will put a link here for you. And um, so, and I will, in short, I will, let me see if I can read this so I can tell you what the investment is because I'm not one of those that reads these things. I'm going to have to make it bigger. Oh, you go bigger for me, darling. Go bigger for me. Hey, oh, God, that's so big now. <laughs> No, I can't even see it. Okay, let's go all this way. Okay, so the Liberate Me Creation by Soul Design Embodiment Creme. Okay, it includes the Rise in a Circle, which is a signature root wound program, which is around 6997 in itself, 6,999. Well, not talking sense, but 6997. Okay, <laughs> right. Um, it includes uh, many other programs as well, okay, which are worth you know, thousands of dollars as well, okay? So I've just put it all into one and the creme itself and the creation by Soul Design Emporium. 
Um, she is the queen of the work. Oh my gosh, bless you, Lena. Thank you so much. Um, so the program is worth $30,000 for 12 months. And as this grows, and as we get the word out there of this unknown modality, it will go up to, to $30,000 for 12 months, okay? Um, or that would be 10 payments of $3,000, okay? But for those inside of this right now, um, we had it at the promotion when we did Creation by Soul Design at $9,000 paying full for the entire year or eight nine seven per month, okay? That is $24 a day and that was a good offer then. It's since going up. And now I'm just going to do this birthday bonanza, okay? So just really think about that for a second, okay? And the return investment, okay? Um, and like I say, we're very specific about the creations, okay? So how much money would you like to create this year or this month? And do the math, okay? Um, so big savings there. But, 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 I sound like one of those um, salespeople now, and I don't want to sound like that. <laughs> But what we're doing for my birthday, which is what I'm really, really excited about, is um, taking this, the $9,000 for the entire year, to have 50% off, and that is only for those that contact me and PM me from the minute, from the moment you PM me, remember, whenever you watch this, um, and it has to be this week, okay? Definitely in the next five days, I will not go beyond that, okay? And that's only if you didn't watch this live now. But as soon as I get your PM, okay, you have 24 hours from there to ask your questions. We can go through things and to decide and go for it. So 50% off, which is $4,500, okay? If you want to do payment plans, there are some options for that, okay, on the discount. But we can talk about those separately, um, but they would incur some interest, okay? So um, if you want to make a bigger saving, then go for the full pay. But we can talk about that, okay? This works out to, ladies, $12 a freaking day, okay? That's like two coffees. I hate saying that because I know lots of people say that. But still, it is quite telling, isn't it? And it is crazy. I mean, it's absolutely insane for the high-level bespoke boutique activating coaching that we do here in Liberate Me, okay? This isn't a one-size-fits-all. This is really that one-on-one -on -one intention. And we will grow to become much, much bigger um, when this goes up to $30,000 a year. So uh, get in now, okay? Um, and you're going to get a lot more attention and you're going to get my attention, okay? Because as we grow, I will have to bring in some cold coaches uh, uh, or activators. Um, so that this is really important, okay? So this is uh, absolutely insane. So the way to decide, darlings, isn't through logic, okay? Because that would be for your false traits, okay? The way to decide is to go into your inner compass, into your feminine traits, and ask, do I want this? Do I want this? Okay, and feel it, okay? And if it's up energy, then go for it. You know, find a way, okay? So not from logic, not from fear, okay? Because that's all false traits, okay? Um, and it's from the place of knowing that this will create what you desire and far more than you can even imagine, okay? But I can help you with that, but this is an empowered decision. None of this is about me trying to convince you or any of that freaking jazz, okay? That's not my, that's not my jam. That is not my jam, okay? So what does this include? So this includes, um, like I say, the Liberate Me Embodiment Creme, 12 months. We have weekly calls. And we're likely, depending on time zones, we take it to one or two calls a week. Okay, they last about two hours. You get one-to-one -one sort of your own, one-to-one -one activation. You get weekly one-to-one -one activation readings. Okay, you get the Rise in a Circle signature program, which I said is, you know, 6997 on its own. Um, you get the Creation by Soul Design um, Emporium, okay, which is all around the human design, your personal soul design around that and how to activate all those creation powerhouses, you just get freaking tons, okay? Tons and tons and tons, okay? Um, the, the Rise in a Circle program to release your root wound as a bonus is freaking bonkers. I can't even tell you, okay? I can't even get that across. I mean, you could decide to just do that alone if you want, but why would you do that, 
because of the price of that. You know, the investment of that is now higher at this 50% off, okay, um, for the 4,500. That's 6,997 on its own, okay, 12 weeks, okay? Um, so I love it. I love it. I love doing this for you. And it means that you get the full package, okay? Um, Lena says, I have done so much healing, much work for years. Nothing I have has even come close to touching this work. Anyone that does this will not regret jumping into this program. Oh, Lena, thank you so much for saying that. I have to screen capture these and share them. It's so nice to share these things. Thank you. So much, I meant. <laughs> the excitement. Thank you, Lena. Um, yeah, so I love this for you because you get the full package and I love giving. It's my favorite thing, you know, and that's why I love, you know, bringing lots of money in and bringing lots of abundance in for myself, for you, so we can give, okay? So this is a revolutionary program, okay? I can't get that across enough. That identifies and removes, removes the root wound um, and it's absolutely amazing, okay? Absolutely amazing. I will put some links here so you can read a bit more. I don't have sales pages and things like that. There's a, there's a few bits and pieces that you can have a look at. There's some audios if you wanna go into that and have a listen to those. There's a brochure there, but it's just amazing. It really needs to come you know, from a, a yes inside, okay? And if you've got a yes inside and you're like, yeah, but I don't know how I'm gonna pay for it. I mean, come on, <laughs> this is ridiculous. But if you do have that, then um, you know, reach out and we can see if we can activate that in you, okay, with your permission. So it, it's time to build your own creation power, okay? You are not broken, you do not need fixing, you require activating, okay? And bringing together the world of soul design. Feminine traits, false traits, root wound, hashtag magic logic, okay? The map that Zara talked about, that you're gonna be given that one of a kind bespoke dossier belongs just to you. I will be looking after you personally. That I think will only be happening for this year in Liberate Me. I think next year we're gonna to grow to another level. So you may not have my personal attention and we're doing this live this year and you're getting it at the most unbelievable investment um, um, Brackets, okay, so it's just a great time, right? So, you know, you will be the original crumbs, okay? The creme de la crumbs, okay? Um, which is amazing, okay? Because I just feel like, you know, when we do get to meet up at the rendezvous, wherever that's gonna be, Singapore, maybe Dubai, I don't know, where do you fancy, girls? Let me know, let me know. Um, so, but we definitely be somewhere fancy and amazing, okay? Um, which is included in the creme, okay? The event's included, not the accommodation, the flights, but the event is included. Okay, so it's just fucking incredible, right? Um, so I do believe that we will become, you know, a close-knit group of women, the cremes of Liberate Me. You know, I'm not a guru. I am not your guru, as Tony Robbins says, okay? I'm just here to activate, and you will be able to activate in yourself and empower yourself, okay? And empower, empower others, you know, as you learn all of this. Um, and as we expand, you know, maybe you want to be part of this. Who knows? Maybe one day, okay? Or activate your own, your own for me, it's really important for you to activate your very own spiritual IP and your own gift, okay? So yeah, I'm just getting super excited now, just thinking about the future and our, and our, and our creme time together, okay? So yeah, so this is the whole shebang, ladies. This is all for you, all for you. Happy birthday to me. Yeah, this is me celebrating with you, my gift to you, and you know, for all your desires to come into reality naturally in a relaxed way. And one other bonus, okay? So this bonus is actually part of the Rising Mastery and Unschool program of Spiritual and Energetic Empire Building, which is a business program, okay, which is not included in this, okay? It is not included in this. That's a separate um, program, but there's a map, a false traits map. So it's so funny, Zara, you're talking about maps. That is included in the program. Okay, so there's not one false trait that can escape you, okay? And exactly how to transcend it at speed and turn it into what you desire, okay? So that's another extra bonus that I didn't mention, okay? So who is ready? Who is ready for this magic logic? Let me know in the chat. Give me a hell yes or PM me. I'll, I'll put some information here in the comments once I come off with some links so you can have a look. Um, yeah, so... 
the kind of woman that really comes in to liberate me is the ones that are really ready to pull that mask off, ready for something very different, okay? Um, Lena, Anita is the real thing. She's got, she's got you fully. Amazing. Thank you, Lena. Yes, you are the lucky ones getting this offer. Absolutely. It's true. I'm going to own it, okay? <laughs> I'm going to own it. It's an unbelievable offer. I can't even believe I'm doing it. I can't even believe that my soul design has told me to do this, right? Because, you know, you're not, I'm not making any money out of that, okay? Really think about it, okay? <laughs> so, um, in the long term, this isn't about that. This is, this is what soul design says, and it creates the abundance of the back of us back of that so it can be so illogical okay but you follow it and you have trust in it you know when you know it as well as I do okay and you'll know it that way as well okay as you come in okay so it's for women that want to face it head on have a whole new way of creation and healing okay they are the ones to admit yeah you are the ones to admit that current modalities may just not be quite cutting it or not filling all the gaps at least okay and you know you're on the cusp of a breakthrough or want a breakthrough and are ready to step over that hurdle. The teachings and the way of living in the past are just not doing the job for you, right? Or, so this is the kind of woman that comes in, okay? Also women that are not looking to feel 100% in flow to make a decision to change their lives once and for all. Um, they simply need to make a decision at, their time, at this time that their soul desire desire is saying, come on, you know, I want to do this, okay, let's find a freaking way, it's that kind of woman, okay, that really feels it inside, um, yeah, and maybe, you know, a woman that's held it together for a long time, and maybe been on a long healing journey already, and just hoping that one day, it will, you know, all that effort will fall into place, and it will make sense, and it just doesn't, you know, and something will finally happen, it just doesn't work like that, okay, it never does, okay, and I don't say that to be doom and gloom. It's just the truth of what I know, okay, um, from a very genuine place. So, so it's really a woman that finally screams the truth that something is very wrong here with this current way and way of living and these. Oh, I'm going to pause because I saw it go black. And these modalities, okay. Um, and then really, women that really want to experience a new level of liberation and creation beyond measure, okay. Yeah, so this is really the next evolutionary step in creation. Um, and I honestly, I am here to leave no stone unturned. I am for the magic logic seekers, okay? So not just, you know, cloak and no dagger, okay? This is for the disruptors, the early adopters, the pioneers, and you'll get a great offer today. This is the, for the ones who know real, you know, want to know what real magic creation is. Okay, be, you know, it's still logical, but beyond the logical, okay? And are open to a whole new way of being, living, enjoying, and, and doing this thing called life, you know, where there's a sense of oneness with all the parts inside of you, okay? Um, so I will drop the details in the comments. Please reach out to me if you're interested, okay? So that is 24 hours from when you PM me. Um, and let me see if it's working. Do let me know if you have any questions, okay? So we're gonna close up now, okay? So we've been going for 90 minutes. We were faffing about the start for 10 minutes. So um, we've been going for about 90 minutes. Let me know one word for how you're feeling now. Just one word, just to close off and just to close your space. And just take a nice deep breath, okay? I really, really enjoyed that. So my one word is elated. Okay, what's your one word? Let me know. What's your one word for how you're feeling? Thank you for spending my your um, my birthday, spending my birthday with you guys. So thank you for you showing up here. I really enjoyed that. I've got my words upside down now. I really, really enjoyed spending that time with you, okay? So thank you all for being here. I love you all. Give me um, one word, either now or um, later, yeah? And if you're on the replay, give me a hashtag replay. If you're interested in part of this birthday offer for 50% off, get the freaking touch! And let's have some champagne and celebrate you all, okay? 
Um, I love you all. I'm going to go off now and enjoy the rest of my birthday. Thank you for being here with me. Lena, amazing. Good. I love it. I love it. I love it. Thank you, Zara. Thank you, Manisha. Thank you, Carmen. Sorry if I'm not mentioning anyone. I know a few of you are in the background as well. Thank you all. Hello to all the replay ladies. And um, thank you to you as well. Okay. Um, thank you for being here. Mwah! I love you all. Bye-bye.